Yeah, they. They feel safer whenever they go behind you sometimes. Do they? Yeah. Well, Paco does. Paco feels safer if he's behind me sometimes. I can get kind of thirsty. Yeah. 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 Good crop. That's very How are you doing on groceries, Mom? Yeah, I'm okay. I eat a lot of the same, that's for sure. Yeah. I know you like your tortillas. Yeah, I eat a lot of tortillas and stuff. I know you like milk. Yep, milk. Yeah, that one. What else do you eat, Mom? <laughs> what else do you eat, Mom? Not much. Just for the years, then. It's also just for the years, then, um... And milk and cheese and oh, jeez. Oh, I yeah. don't know how, how it goes. And I help. I forgot. I spend more time back there when she's uh, with, with my tool. Down. Good girl. Down. Good girl. Down. Good girl. Good doggy. Down. Good. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Use your, use your sniffer. I think you like American cheese, is that right, Mom? Like what? American cheese, or is it a different type of cheese? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's 
Sam, do you have an assortment in there, John? No, I just know that you like a specific type of cheese. Oh, yeah, I don't like American cheese at all. Okay. I've always liked cheddar. But anyway. Cheddar cheese, okay. Yeah, cheddar, uh, mild, American, mild cheddar. Mild cheddar, okay. Mild cheddar, yeah. And tortillas from the uh, tortilla shop over on... Uh, Do you eat yogurt still or not really? Yeah, I just never buy it. I'm really lazy about going to the grocery store and yeah. doing that stuff. I got ordered. I think last time I had ordered stuff though. Down. Good girl. Down. She doesn't want to give up the uh, treat. Well, that's okay. I'm not dying to get it in my hand either. That's her treat. You were planning on taking it back with you? Nope. That's good. No, I wasn't going to sleep with it tonight. <laughs> Put it under my pillow. Like a uh, tooth fairy. <laughs> That's an esophagus? No. Um, they do have a... I think they do have a windpipe one. Um... I saw it on, uh, I think, Chewy. Oh, okay. Dot com. They had a windpipe. And I might get that for her because it would be a little bit, maybe it might be a little bit more sturdy. That is know. pretty fragile. I guess so. That looks like an esophagus. You don't think it is? Or what do you think it is? Cheek. They say it's a cheek roll. Oh, really? So it's probably... Hmm. Cheek. I don't know what Did kind it of... come from uh, the Humane Society? Pack. Yep. I think it's like nine bucks or something. So she really enjoys it. She does. Tell me about the weather today in Tucson. Alexa, tell me about the weather today in Tucson. In Tucson, it's 107 degrees Fahrenheit with clear skies and sun. Tonight, you can look for mostly clear skies with a low of 76 degrees. By the way, there's an excessive heat warning in effect from Monday, June 26th. 11 a.m. to Tuesday, June 27, 8 p.m. I think she's a, is afraid that I'm going to take it away now. You think she is? I've never taken this thing away from her. No, I don't think she's as nervous about it. 
right now as she was in the beginning. Yep. Down. Very good. Down. Good girl. I know she, you said that she hardly ever goes out, but when does she go out? Oh, she goes out when she wants to, when she has to go potty and comes back in. That's when? about it, John. I mean, a couple of times. Like during and I the... let her out before I go to bed at night to make sure she goes out. Yeah. Good idea. And then I have to go over and let her out now, but she'd probably come right back in. Oh, definitely. Yeah. She's not stupid. No. She says, somebody turned the heater on outside. I don't want to be out there. No, she doesn't like it when it's hot. Yeah, you got to use your sniffer. There you go, honey bunny. Keep going. To yeah, there you go. Given the opportunity to go in the bathroom, she likes to go in there and take the toilet paper and all the stuff out of the garbage can and oh boy. bring the toilet paper down the hall. Okay. Pick it off the roll and run it down the hall. Same with the other bathroom in the bedroom. There you go. Down. Given Good. the opportunity there, she runs it any place she can oh, take it. As far yeah, as she use can. Your yeah. She takes it off the roll and takes it with her and yeah, that's what Paco does. Also, sometimes when he's got a lot of energy, he wants to he wants to do something, and so he uh, gets in our trash and he pulls our trash can over and starts looking for goodies to chew on. You see that? You see that? Yeah, there you go, honey. Yeah, there you go. Ever since I got the trash can with the lid on it, she doesn't. She doesn't go in there. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, it is. Just about a Costco. It wasn't cheap. It was like a hundred dollar garbage can. Yep. I think they have my Costco. Good. Good girl. Down. Good girl. How long has Alejandra been gone, though? She went gone two weeks or one week or? Yeah, about a week and a half. Yep. What's the 
costume fly down there? I don't know. I don't know why any of that stuff. Her, um, her, her cousin, uh, just, uh, he really, he really thinks Ernesto's, uh, he cares a lot about Ernesto, you know. Uh -huh. And so, um, he likes to spend time with Ernesto. He, whenever he comes down here to Tucson, he likes to likes to see Ernesto. And whenever he goes up there to, or goes goes down there to Mexico City, then then uh, he's pretty happy. So they're staying over at his house right now. But uh, he said one. He said to me he he has a hard time. Speak English. He speaks says a little bit of English. But he he said uh, so when he said you know so when are you coming down here? And I said um, oh I, maybe we need to go somewhere the closer to the ocean. And I, I want to go somewhere closer to the ocean. And he said we'll go to Acapulco. Yeah. And I said okay, it sounds good. So that was the end of that conversation. I. I don't know where we're going, but hopefully we'll do that sometime. We'll go to Acapulco. I want to go to Acapulco. You'd have to get your chair cooked over the sand. Yeah, it would, but but I like the temperature because it's not it's not uh, freezing cold, you know, because it's closer to the ocean. Yeah, it's a temperate climate. Yeah, and it's not hotter I think than. It's, uh, it's I not, think it's I think it's like close to the equator. Yes. Yes. Closer to the equator, it's down there near Central America. Yeah, yeah, it should be pretty mild. Yeah, so I I like that part. And if I if we did go to Acapulco, I would want to go to Acapulco in the winter, whenever it's colder than the geezers here. Yeah. You know, like I think January 10th is like supposed to be the coldest day of the year or something like that. Where here? Here. Oh, I didn't know that. Yep. Um, I think it's like, that's the shortest day as far as the sun being out. That's the shortest time that the sun is out during the day. Mm -hmm. And, um, yeah, so, so anyway, I, I, it's not solstice. Solstice is, I think solstice is whenever the sun is out the longest. I, I don't know. Yeah, there's a summer solstice and a winter solstice. Yeah, winter solstice. I think that's probably at the shortest time, and the summer solstice would be the longest time. Yep. Of daylight. Yeah. But I kind of want to. I kind of want to see the animal shelters down in Apoco, I, Acapulco. I know that they have an animal shelter in uh, Rocky Point, but I. But I wanted to go to the animal shelter in Acapulco because I, I just love animals. I love doggies. Yeah. And uh, you know, even though we might speak different languages, we're still gonna we're still yeah. gonna be pretty much the same mm -hmm. doggies. I think Alejandro's cousin might be okay to do something like that, but Alejandro would have a pretty hard time going to a shelter because she wants to take them all home with her. Yeah, I know. That's the problem mm -hmm. with me, too. I want to take them all with me. Yeah. I also want to go scuba diving sometime. Really? I think that would be fun to go scuba diving um, because you don't need your legs too much for that. I mean, you do to kick, to go float, to go in the water, but I mean, most of the time, just hanging out, you know. I think if I had paddles on my hands and I could pretty much get anywhere I need to go in the water.
You remember Glenn Walker, honey? Yeah. Uh, I think he was talking about, him and I were talking about that one time on Facebook. Really? Yeah. What's he doing? He turned out to be a doctor just like his dad? Yeah. Um, the last time I saw, I saw a picture of him, he had a, a bolo tie on. Oh, really? You know? <laughs> he was looking pretty sharp. 